I'm Charles Poisson, Director of Group Sustainability and Director of R&D of the Molding Division of Storopac. Our EPS by Storopac is the first EPS made of host consumer packaging scraps for packaging application. We were the first molded manufacturer with a fully integrated solution. Everything is produced and developed internally and we are very proud of that. Expanding polystyrene is one of the most commonly used protective packaging for white goods or electronic parts as example. Our REPS combines sustainability with the exceptional material properties of EPS like good shock absorption, lightweight, excellent insulation or superb moldability. That means that the molded protective packaging made of 100% of our EPS not only offer an improved carbon footprint, but also the same reliable protection as product in conventional uh, EPS. Storopack already delivered numerous of protective packaging with 100% of our EPS with different key customers in Europe. The first ever protective packaging made of 100% of our EPS was uh, for a well-known customer in the medical sector for transport of chemical solutions for highest protection. Another reference in the high-tech sector is the delivery of the first protective packaging of high-quality wireless uh, speakers. These high-value speakers are well protected while reducing the environmental impact and with a very high quality in terms of appearance with this very nice grey color. As packaging often has a short useful life, it is imperative to collect and reuse it in the best eco-friendly way. First step, the collect. To be more efficient in terms of environmental impacts or cost, we collect packaging EPS scraps from municipalities, local recyclers or directly from customers. We have a partnership between a big French retailer of electronic goods and an EPS recycler. When the retailer delivers electronic goods at your home, they take back the EPS packaging to be recycled. Second step, the beads production. We develop an innovative process to transform the compacted EPS into new beads ready for molding. Third step is the molding of a new packaging. In our molding plant, we expand the REPS beads in order to achieve a very low density as a standard EPS. And at the end, we inject in a mold the expanded beads. With this uh, third step, we are closing uh, the loop. That's what circular economy means for us. It is important to recycle EPS because recycling is one uh, of the simplest and smart solutions to reduce plastic waste in our environment. Typically, using our EPS can lead to a decrease of water consumption, climate change or fossil resources.